they played very hard. They played for, hard for each other, and they played hard for Hawaii. I think uh, they uh, they should feel good about themselves. Now, they need to realize this, the the statement they made. People are, aren't going to take Hawaii very lightly the rest of the season, so they need to practice better and better every day. Um, in no way should they feel like they arrived. They should be proud of themselves, but we need to move on because San Jose can play. We hadn't really been off since camp, so I think rest kind of, you know, helped us get back into it. And then the mentality of not wanting to lose. There's a lot of guys on our team now I feel like are really trying to turn it around, not just for this year, but for years to come too. The first, it was tough those first four games, but that bye week really helped us because we had an extra few days to prepare for Nevada, and our coaches were trying to uh, make the point, you know, in our head that we can we can be great. And I think that we all believed in it, had a good week of practice, and it showed out there. Um, I'm, you know, we always looking our chops at another game now. Saturday, like I said, is the best day of the week, but you never underestimate anybody. I mean, as good as we did, we always got a lot to fix, a lot to work on. So we're going to keep working while we can work. And then when Saturday comes, party time. We're going to try to play just like we did last week, fast, aggressive, you know, get to the quarterback. Get, hopefully we get them to third down, stop the run on first and second so we can come after them on third down. With San Jose, I, I don't care about their record. That's a tough quarterback. That quarterback reminds me, he's been hit a lot this year, but he gets up. He reminds me of Sean Schroeder. You know, you, everyone had, even in the league, had a lot of respect for Schroeder because he always got up and he always kept playing. This kid's got a little bit of that in him. So uh, we're going to need to bring it. And they got a bunch of skill positions that can make plays. With, with the big big game New Mexico had, you know, San Jose put up 41 points. You know, New Mexico just executed very well on offense, and, you know, they've got some speed. So uh, I don't think – I think their scheme brings some, some issues that, that are new for us, and I don't think it's – if, if our guys start looking at that and think that we're going to just line up and run the ball without working hard, they're, they're crazy. Um, but for our identity uh, – that was that was good for us the other night. I think we've got a lot of ways to get some players on this on this offensive side of the ball, the ball. And there's a lot of guys that contributed, and uh, I, I think that really helps the the mindset on offense. There was a lot of unselfishness. They didn't, nobody cared that Diosmi got those carries. You know, I was, I was happy for Paul Harris. You know, he's been very unselfish, um, and to have a few big runs was good. Uh, Kiwi Chung got in the end zone. Stephen Laka Laka didn't have the stat wise game that that he may have had earlier but he he was happy for the other guys you know Tuyunga a guy who was this close from being off this football team to switch his his mindset and how he lived to get that kind of success really sends a message to the whole football team and our recruits that this is how we want you to act and that's going to lead to positive play on the field we're uh we're picking up where we left off. We're improving on in our pass pro, improving our blocking, improving everything. I feel like we're going to do a really good job. It feels great. I'm just, I'm kind of happy. It's not just like a strictly passing offense that's kind of balanced out right at this point. So, if uh, me and the running backs are really enjoying this. You know, I like to feel the today's practice. I like the direction that the team's going in, and I feel like if we keep this up, you know, we can be deadly in the Mountain West. We have a, a bunch of good running backs, and our O line is great. Um, anytime you can run the ball for ton of yards it makes it easy on the quarterback um, so I mean when you run the ball that well we can you know what I mean I don't have an issue just handing off the ball um, but that being said like if if we don't run the ball as well like I'm ready for for us to be able to throw the ball as well um, but like I said our own line is doing a great job our running backs are doing a great job as well I'm really excited uh, I haven't seen my dad since I came out here and uh, he hasn't been able to really see me play except for on TV so like I know that he's excited. I'm I'm pretty stoked to to play in front of some family and friends.